Bonjour. Bonjour. Could you introduce yourself? Good morning. My name is Marine Le Fenton. I am a medical doctor working in the neuroimagery unit of Rennes University Hospital France as a part of the team held by Dr. Carson Nicole. Pourquoi? Why is a foreign ferromagnetic body located within the brain considered a counterindication to an MRI? There is always a risk of lesions of the neighboring structures associated with the presence of the potential movement of a foreign ferromagnetic body. Besides, its presence can also induce a change in local temperature, damaging the tissues furthermore. Finally, its ferromagnetic composition is also known to generate artifacts. Est-ce qu'un corps étranger is a foreign ferromagnetic body found within the limb a contraindication to an MRI? Contraindication à l'IRM. Non, la présence d'un corps étranger ferromagnétique. No, it is not a contraindication per se. Nous serons prudents si ce corps. However, we will proceed with more caution if the foreign body's intrusion is recent. It's why we usually wait a few days so there is enough time for a fibroinflammatory reaction to occur and secure the foreign body's position as to avoid potential movements. En considération, la proximité éventuelle de ce corps étranger avec une structure vasculaire avoisinante, avec le risque potentiel de lésion. Avez-vous, dans votre expérience, have you ever encountered in your career patients that received an MRI even though they presented with an intraorbital foreign ferromagnetic body or one that was located in the eyelid? Our team has already encountered situations where these objects were found by chance, whether they would be located in the periorbital or palpebral region. What were the consequences for the patients? Certain patients some of them describe discomfort, even more so when the foreign body was located in the palpebral region, but there was no significant clinical implication. We were disturbed by the artifacts generated by the material when exploring the region. For the exploration of the zone of interest linked to the artifacts engendered by the foreign body. In view of our work at the CHU of Rennes, Judging by the research led by Rennes University Hospital Ophthalmology Ward and Neuroimaging Unit, is a ferromagnetic foreign body with a diameter under 3 mm located within the eyelid, a counterindication to a 3 tesla MRI? No. No, we do not consider it a counterindication to this exam. Même question. Same question if it were located within the orbits. Alors là, nous serons beaucoup plus prudents. We would proceed with more caution and there must be a formal indication to an MRI. We would also only be using an MRI set at 1.5 Tesla and ideally only for those located in the extraconical area.